Hello, today I'm going to be talking about Wild by Cheryl Strait, specifically parts 4 and 5. Now, in these sections, uh, one thing that comes up once or twice are Cheryl's toenails, and specifically how she's losing her toenails because her feet are in pretty bad shape. Now, I am inclined to believe that her toenails symbolize some of her other losses that she's gone through. Um, in the literal sense, her feet have been hurting and her toes really not doing so good. And then, as it says on page 201, I limped back to my camp and examined my tortured big toes. To so much as gaze against them had been had become excruciating. I could literally see them throbbing. The blood beneath my feet pulsating in a regular rhythm that flushed my nails white then pink. White then pink. They were so swollen that it looked as if my nails were simply going to pop off. It occurred to me then that popping them off might actually be a good idea. Then there's this part. I pinched one of the nails, and with a solid tug pulled, followed by a second of searing pain, the nail gave away, and I felt instant, almost total relief. So, when she wants to take care of her feet and get rid of the toenails, they're hurting her now, but after a little bit of pain, everything gets better. And, um... Uh, looking back at it, that reminded me of this other section a couple pages later on 210. Because we had not been safe from a destruction after my mom died, total destruction would now come as a relief. The loss of my family and home were my own private clear-cut. What remained was only ugly evidence of a thing that was no more. So, her, the comparison that I see is that, um, like her family life, um, it would almost be better to have no family at all than to have the really bad remnants or you know of a shattered family kind of because all that does is remind her of what she used to have with her mom and so to connect the two back together um, she went through a little bit of pain to make her toenails feel better whereas theoretically if all of her family was gone it'd be painful then but she'd learn to move on and get over it and she would just deal with not having a family now maybe that's kind of a weird comparison but I, I just see that a little bit um so then later though she kind of changes her mind sort of um there's a part where she is really angry at her mom um like, it was so awful that my mother had been taken from me, I couldn't even hate her properly. And that's on page 267. But, like, she... She realizes that even though her mother had faults and, like, kind of hurt her at some times, she was still a really good mother. She loved her a lot. She always knew that her mom loved her, basically. And then, so, after her change of heart about her mom that um, kind of is sort of reflected if we continue with the comparison when later she loses her sixth toenail she only has four intact toenails left on page 307 it says the PCT and I weren't tied anymore the score was four to six advantage trail and so if you make the connection between her toenails and like her family and stuff that could kind of symbolize her uh, change of heart about her mom in a way um, where it's hurting less even though she's lost a lot of things and so for those reasons I kind of think that her toenails and the pain that her feet are causing her it kind of symbolizes the loss that she's had in her family and how she's trying to move on.